Trump kids across the country are fleeing in terror from uncomfortable ideas, retreating into now omnipresent safe spaces where they can live lives free of scary ideas they don't understand. Now Adam Carolla wants to put them at risk. He's teaming up with radio host Dennis Prager to make a documentary film called No Safe Spaces. We're going to travel the country and ask college kids about the suppression of dissent on campus. Here's part of it. The University of Tomorrow is here. A place of discovery, tolerance, and acceptance. Our commitment to diversity means that nobody graduates until they think just the right way. At Utopia University, there are no violent words to hurt me. I will punch you if you're a fascist. I'm going to be the next Che Guevara. We speak out against privilege. We've, We've checked, checked our, our privilege. privilege. Welcome to Utopia U. A wonderful place to learn that everything your parents taught you is wrong. Adam Kroll and Dennis Prager join us now. Boy, this, this film is overdue. Adam, what did you learn in traveling the country? <laughs> Uh, well, so far, we've only hit a couple of colleges, but all you have to do is watch your show and you'll learn everything you need to know about campuses turning into a romper room. I mean, it's so distressing. D Dennis, when, you're, when you talk to these kids, do they know how unfree they are? They don't care. This is what's so disturbing. Uh, what was it? A Pew poll, I think it was. About half of the kids at college in America today believe in freedom of speech because the others when you ask them and you could see this on, on the internet it's amazing to watch these kids say this oh we believe in free speech just not for hate speech not understanding that nobody ever really needed to protect love speech well <laughs> hate speech is not actually a legal category kind of hilarious yeah. that they think it is so a right. adam when you when you go to these camp you got the biggest podcast in the world by the way congratulations on that when you show up on these you. college campuses or when you deal with college students do they understand that things are very different now from the way they were when you were in college? Do they sort of know that, that they're in the middle of this moment, or do they think it was always this way? Uh, I wasn't in college, but thank you. I was on a construction <laughs> site picking I up garbage. That's my favorite thing about yes. you. I forgot that. The only, I love only hydrating it. I did was a gourd full of my own tears, Tucker. Uh, no, they'll, they'll remind me of that kid from the Twilight Zone who's just going to wish anyone into the cornfield who disagrees with them. And we're all so scared to be wished into the cornfield by these little snot-nosed brats that we just follow suit. You know, okay. uh, it's actually, we're making this movie, and it's at no, nosafespaces.com. We're making this movie, but the truth is it's impossible to parody what actually takes place. Harvard, and I, I want all your viewers to look this up, because what I'm about to say will sound like we made it up, or certainly like Adam made it up. At Harvard, they announced, I think it was last week, that no longer will there be fines on your overdue library book, which is 50 cents a day, by the way, 50 cents a day, because we understand how much pressure a Harvard student already has on him or her. You don't have to pay your overdue book fine. Then why, I mean, the obvious question, final question to you, Adam, since you didn't go to college and you did just fine, why would you send your kids to college? Great question. I would like you to come and speak to my wife, Ducker, because I've been saying this for a million years. Yep. I'm, I'm just, we're just sending them to be poisoned, yep. like exactly. that Nike commercial. Like they're out in the audience wearing gray jumpsuits and uh, being indoctrinated into these horrible ideologies. To be fair, some of them should be scared when the giant Jewish guy comes and yells at them. But other than that, they have no excuses. Right, I'm very scary. I really do. I scare them. Well, yeah, I, I it's hope the you whole do thing. Scare it's them. painful. <laughs> yes, it is. Yes, you're no right. safe spaces is the movie, and every person on the show is going to watch that. Thank you, guys. Thank Thanks, you. Thanks, Tucker.